What's good, YouTube? It's your boy TJ LaFave, and this is a 757 collection video where I am just gonna show off all my 757s up to this point. And I have seven 757s in my collection up to this point. Should have made that run a bit better. <laughs> and these two are in the middle because these two are my first two models that I ever got. Yeah. You know, when I first officially started collecting models, I got two planes, a double order of this American Airlines 757-200 and US Airways 757-200. And here are the boxes, respectfully. Uh, move that United plane a bit with the box. Um, so yeah, there's the box. Any information on the inside of that? You could read that. Shouldn't be anything different. This is a 2008 release model. Um, nothing special about the box. Again, standard Gemini Jets box. And this US Airways is a uh, 2007 release. So it's even older by a year. Um, both were released before I started, obviously. But a while before I started collecting. Because I started collecting in, oh, 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 2009-ish I started collecting can't remember the exact date. It was around ninth grade. So 2009 I started collecting. It's 2015 now, so 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 6. I'm too lazy to do the math in my head. <laughs> 6, 8, 2009, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yeah, 6 this year. 6, 6, 7. I'm, I'm too lazy to really do the math. <laughs> And here's that. There's different information on the inside. Uh, yeah, I don't really... All the plain information, that's it. <laughs> Just four little things. This is, again, another standard Gemini Jets box, though. And here's the models themselves, which, despite the age and the fact they were first in my collection, I am proud to say that I've kept these planes in... This plane, these two planes, in very, very good condition. They're a little bit dusty, but essentially they're still as good as the day I put them in the box. It's just over time, the chrome messes up just from being exposed to the light. My 7.6 American, you see the real damage, but luckily these 7.5, both of them. This is a, from a newer release. This isn't the same release. It was like a different release later on that this American 7.5 because it's different registrations. This one is November... November 601 Alpha. Wait a minute. Yeah, November 601 Alpha November. And this registration is... November 602 Alpha November. So 602 and 601. And obviously the rest of the planes are clearly different. If I can get, get it to focus. There you go. Gotta tap the screen mad times with this iPhone. <laughs> my phone got stolen too a couple of weeks ago. Just, just, just to throw out some news real quick. My phone got stolen two weeks ago when I went to the pool, and I had to get a new one. And I got the exact same phone. And yeah, iPhone 5C. And I just got it in the mail two days ago. I was planning to make this video a week ago, but yeah, issues with that. So yeah, back to these planes. The newest one here is obviously this American 752 in new colors. Beautiful detail. I love that American tail. Used to hate it, but now I love it. Delta looks beautiful. And United, equally beautiful. And then there's the Delta 753. I wish I had it with winglets, but it's still a beautiful plane. And that's the 75 collection for now. The next video I'll do would be all my. Airbus family airplanes, and then I'll do 73 family Airbus, 73 seven family collection, yada yada. Move on, but for now, the next next video that I plan to make is a Q and A video, and I want you guys in the comments below to ask me any question you want, just anything, and. I will answer the question. I don't care if it's aviation based or if it's not aviation based. I'll, I'll, I just want to answer some questions because on Instagram 
and in YouTube, people be asking me questions. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just do a video about it. Answer all your questions in one shot, one go. So that's that's it for this video. Just give me a question in the comments below, and also comment what you think about the planes. You know, they're nice. You know what you like about this. General feedback about my videos and how I'm presenting them. That's always good. That's always good. And the Q&A thing. I'm going to do a special video where I answer all you guys' questions from Instagram and YouTube. I already put a, put a post on Instagram. Any questions you want. You It could be about aviation. could not be about aviation. I really don't care. I'm not expecting to get that much questions, but who knows. And anyways, thanks for watching this long. Even with all my rambling, I know I have a tendency to go off on tangents. But thank you for watching the video. And we'll just end on the shot of these two. My first two models, beautiful as hell. Thanks for watching.